What? Do you want it and all? No. Get yourself out the motor, dickhead. You see that? In there? Zero miles an hour. This, this is why I'm late for everything. Like, this is mental. For the... Oh, my phone never stops. I like the big job. Okay, been in the car now for half an hour. It should have taken me five minutes. This is literally, literally wasting my day away. This is this is crazy. This is crazy. Zero. Zero miles an hour. Nothing. Nada. The car isn't even on. So, eventually made it to the office. I always like to play the guessing game as to how many parcels are going to be here. Can you guys guess? Three. That's just a bin. <laughs> okay. At first, most people say my office is a lot smaller than they first... When they uh, first walk into it? It is. It's a lot smaller, isn't it, than you think? It's tiny. But when you look at it on the big wide lens... Mental. <laughs> yeah. So I know you guys are probably like, Alex, why is Superfy Guy in the office? Um, well, it's Superfy Guy day off, week off, week off? Week off. Week off work this week. So uh, we thought we'd hang out. We chose Thursday to do that. And I want, something to show. I want to show you something right now. Did you see what I installed on the editing desk? I did. Do you like them or not? They're yeah. bows. What do you think of bows? Yeah, bows are good. Bows are good. No, they're not really. No, you, no. You... <laughs> it's, it's a good job it's this computer, not yours. <laughs> I know, it's not mine. You have these at your house though, don't you? I do. These are really cool. I love these. These are the edifier. What are they called again? Uh, M25, E25. E25. Very M25, cool. E25 by edifier. You can get me different colours. Have you got the red ones? I've got the red ones. I yeah. like the red ones. So I'm not going to be, you guys can call him Paul if you want, or Paul Superfy, or I'm more than happy with Superfy guy. Paul's fine. Paul's, Paul's fine, fine, is it? Paul's yeah. fine. So as you guys have noticed, yes, we're in my office, we're not in Superfy, and we've come to the office. We haven't really spoke about speaker systems and stuff, because as you guys know, I told you the other day, we get the new house on the 27th. Did I tell you that? You watched the vlog, didn't you? I probably watched the vlog. 27. <laughs> so as soon as we get the house, that is the next That is the next port of call. Paul's gonna come round and we're gonna look at the garage and all the rooms and see where the home cinema's gonna go. We're gonna plan from there. But now, I told you guys, I forgot to put the link in uh, the last video. I, I think it was last week. I visited Superfy and I was telling you guys that Paul, Superfy guy, actually runs an Instagram that has, it's all about computers, isn't it? It's all about computers. It's Real called computer. Battle Rigs. Battle Rigs. So I'll put the link in the description. If you guys like computers, go follow that Instagram. And Paul and I might be working on a few little projects on there. Maybe, uh, we might be uh, doing custom orders and uh, building the PCs live on a live stream and then sending them sort of out to you. How sick would that be? So uh, go follow Battle Rigs. I'll put, a, I'll put a link in the description. And I like Paul for setting that up because he's, uh, he's doing something unique. And I like that. Have you enjoyed visiting the office? Amazing. Do you like it? It's a lot smaller. What's the one word you'd use to describe it though? Uh, it's mental, but it's really small. <laughs> it's mental. <laughs> Parcels, I'll come back. I'll come back for you later. Right then, super fight guy. Get back on your train. <laughs> we've had a good time though, we've had a good time. We've talked computers, we've talked super fi hi-fis and audio equipment and LS50s and loads of things. But it's time to call this ship to an end. When is your train? 20 past. 20 past. Right then, bro. I will see you next time. All right then, bro. Catch you next time. Yeah, dude. Cheers, dude. Now, guys, I need to go off to CrossFit. Today is absolutely manic. I'm not going to CrossFit to work out. I'm going to CrossFit because you guys know I did the awesome video for them. Uh, you all know this. I've finished all of the videos now. We wanted loads of changes doing to them. Not because I was a bad videographer, because things changed in the actual shop and he didn't release the videos. Silly him. So I've got his hard drive with me, guys. I just I need to go and drop off his hard drive with all the completed videos on it. Today, today's been manic so far, but I've really, really enjoyed it. Okay, so guys, this is the sort of unfiltered dash cam footage of uh, what happened with this guy uh, that I put in the thumbnail at the start of the video, and I put the video on Twitter yesterday. So as you can see, I sat in the car here, um, and I assumed that there was some sort of crash or, or, or something, because the traffic just wasn't moving whatsoever. Um, and then if you just sort of fast forward it a little bit, right to about here, you see that I have to slam my brakes on, because this guy in front brakes, and I literally almost crash into him. And then if you guys listen to this bit here... So as you can see, you can see the red van there, uh, and there's a white van pulled in. Now, looking at the footage back again, you can see that the white van sort of jolted. I don't know if he crashed or he slammed on his brakes, but then you can obviously see that there's a problem between these two vans, and that is essentially why the red van, the guy in the red van is annoyed.
So if you fast forward a little bit, I'm sat there, and I didn't know if these this black car and the white van in front of this black car were involved in the whole thing, and I just didn't want any part of it, because I thought I'm somehow just going to get dragged into this. Don't really want to be a part of it. Which I ended up doing anyway, so I just thought at the time, right, I'm just going to go around them, the road is clear, I'm just going to go around it all. And at which point I go around them all, everybody starts moving, so I pull back in, and then... What are you doing? What are you doing? Do you want it at all? What? Do you want it at all? No. Get yourself out the motor, dickhead. Clever little c Right, and as you can see by what he said to me, he says, Do you want, do it, you all? want, do it, you want all? it at all? Now, this Get footage has been shown to a police officer so far, and uh, what they have said is that they need to investigate further with all the people involved because pretty much says that with this van that I've put on screen back now, he must have been having a problem with this guy and he might have hit this guy or something might have happened because he said, do you want it? You know, he's saying, do you want it and all, as in like, do you want it as well as if he's already hit somebody? So there's uh, there's definitely some issues going on. And, and if you do a reg check on the van in front, it's actually not a red van. It's a white van. And you can see that by this screenshot when he opens up the door, you can see clearly that it's meant to be uh, a, a white van so there's obviously something dodgy going on here but uh, you guys take as it is and I'll leave it at that but I know I'm going to get comments like Alex why didn't you you know why didn't you get out of the car and batter him why didn't you do this why didn't you do that look with people like this, obviously, you know, he could have had a bad day, could have something going on. I don't know. There's no point in 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 pointing fingers and being really harsh here. There's no point in, you know, in hitting anybody or, or doing anything in, in stupid. The best thing to try and do is try and calm people down and come to some sort of rational conclusion. And that was what I was trying to do. There's no point in, in, in hitting anybody or doing anything mental. So please don't comment that. I've arrived at CrossFit. Um, that was absolutely mental. I've never experienced anything like that with anybody on the roads in my life. What an absolute, absolute bane of the earth. Absolute scumbag. If I ever see him again, right, he'll wish he's never done that. Big words from Mars Bar. I also have some very big friends. <laughs> he was a big guy. Not strong, it was just a bit like blah, blah, blah. Lucky I'm uh, really good friends with the police force in my local town. Like, they kind of know me very, very well. So I'll be passing that footage off to them and seeing what they make of it. Um, I'm pretty sure he didn't really know who he was messing with, did he? Right, into CrossFit. Guys, sweet. <laughs> so then, guys, he must have just been having a bad day. I have no idea, but we're fine. We're good. Everybody's fine. Nobody died. I was the bigger guy, and that is exactly what you should be in a situation like that. What an absolute. What word do we use here, Alex? Let's have a look. Scumbag. So guys, we've got ourselves a few parcels here. I've, unfortunately, I can't flick the knife open anymore. It's really annoying. I used to love flicking the knife open, but it got like really, as if it was gonna break, it was all coming apart. So I've had to tighten it all up, and now I've got to like really yank it open. I don't know if you guys can see that, but if you're wondering, M-Tech. I think this is all stuff that I've ordered, but I've sort of forgotten what I ordered. Um, oh yeah, this is for, uh, this is for the house. It's one of those uh, smart plug things. I want to be able to say, Alexa, turn off the monitors. And it turns off my three screens at home. And because I've already got the TP-Link stuff at home, I know it's expensive, but I may as well use it. But I've got a whole live video on TechFlow coming out tonight, guys, about how to smarten up your home with like smart plugs and LEDs and, and smart lights, all voice controlled with your assistants. Really, really cheap. That'll be out on TechFlow tonight. This stuff, this expensive. TechFlow video, cheaper stuff does the same thing. Do the cheaper stuff. Okay guys, this is uh, this is really, really cool. Really, really, really cool, because I've already had one in my life, but I needed to buy another one. This thing here, you're gonna be like, Alex, what the hell have you bought that for? What it does is it uh, it goes around my keys um, like, like, like that. I had one on it before and it broke. You can get different ones, but I prefer this one. This one is the one that I actually like, so. Uh, and there we go guys, just like that, I have a surround back around my key. The car originally comes with just like a black one, but with these minis you can buy like cool different surrounds for your keys. So uh, I like this John Cooper Works one, soon as I, I drive a John Cooper Works mini, that one's cool. Okay guys, new keys, new smart plug. Huh, what do we have here? Haha, <laughs> oh yes, very boring, much boring, but very smelly. Ooh. 
There we go. That should uh, sort of just keep the office nice and smelly. <laughs> Guys, we can all relax. I feel a little bit bewildered, actually. I was in London yesterday in the new office space, checking all of that out. Then the day before that, I had about 15,000 phone calls, and I was installing wireless stuff for my grandma, and the phone calls were about the new house, which is now all secured. And now I've just had some guy shouting at me all morning in the car, and now I've really got nothing to do. I feel really lost. I think I've sort of got all my work done at the start of this week, and it's now Thursday today, and I've got nothing to do. Um, they sent me some Yankee candles for the car as well, with the, uh, well, I bought these, and then they sent me these as well, so thanks, Yankee. Guys, I just wanted to go ahead and give all of you a massive reminder that number one, my camera is awesome autofocus, and number two, guys, and this is the most important one, and you all need to pay really close attention to what I'm saying right now. I do think, unfortunately, guys, it is slightly too late to get your tickets, but if you still really want to, I'm at Insomnia on Saturday. Meet and greet is at four o'clock, so if you do want to meet me and you didn't know that, I have been telling you guys throughout social media and everything that I'm gonna be there. I'd honestly, guys, love, I'd love, I'd love, I'd love for you to come meet me. We can have selfies, I can speak to you, you can ask me any questions, and I would, I'd love that. I really would, because you guys, well, everything I do in my life revolves around you guys watching the videos, and I'd like to say thank you in person other than doing that on other social medias and stuff, which you can follow me here, here, and here. Other than that, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end today's daily vlog here. Guys, I think, I think I'm gonna be giving away an iPhone X to you guys tomorrow to say a massive, massive thank you for all the support recently, guys. I really, really appreciate it. Guys, my name's Manage, you guys have been awesome, guys. Stay awesome, keep smiling, and I'll see you in tomorrow's daily vlog. Adios! Yeah. Bitch, I've been blowing up. Bitch, I've been blowing up. Everyone's showing up. Where was you in the beginning? I knew that it's showing up. Know that it's showing up. Only come around and fuck with me. When the boy with him, no, you do not know enough. You do not know You do not know a thing about this life that I'm living. You never been low enough. Never been low enough. Yeah, I was born at the bottom. Yeah. Everything yeah. I'm giving.